What is going on, everybody? Welcome back to Rockstar NFT. We got some NFT news here for you today on CryptoNews.com. We're talking about monthly NFT sales on Bitcoin fall over 62%. And But before we get into the video, as always, I want to say I'm not a financial advisor. This is not financial advice. Do your own due diligence and research before you invest. Remember, these videos are for educational purposes only. Hit the subscribe button down below and turn on the bell for notifications so you know when we post more crypto news here on the channel. And remember that your positive contributions and education and knowledge do help people like myself and others learn more about this cryptocurrency NFT gig and how well and lucrative the investments can be. So please help people and be positive about it. All right. So, yeah. Bitcoin sales on NFTs have fallen over 62%. However, there has been a lot of greenery on the NFT charts over the past 24 hours, and the total sales volume is up 12.5% to 34,800, or sorry, 34,820,790 per Crypto Slam said. Now, buyers, sellers, and transactions are all up 3 to 8%. And the top collection by sales volume today is Lock Deal NFT with $2.7 million. It's also making NFT news rounds as the day's top performer with the highest jump by far with a whopping 3,223% uh, increase, which is amazing. Now, in comparison, the second best performer is Frog Froganoz, which is up 59%. Now, as for top blockchains, Bitcoin has seen a drop of 12% to $7.4 million, and at the same time, its competitor Solana jumped 2% to $8.7 million. So as I've always said, I'm very supportive of the Solana blockchain, and I'm likely going to be doing more investing into that in certain areas. So it might be time for you guys to check out Solana again. Just saying, it's a good blockchain. It seems to be thriving really well, and there's some really good coins on that blockchain and NFTs as well. Now, it is significantly increasing the distance between the two warring chains. Ethereum with 9.5 million remains undisturbed at the number one spot at the moment. But we're not done with Bitcoin because today in NFT news, monthly NFT sales on Bitcoin have fallen over 60% as Quantum Cat's mint gets postponed and Pudgy Penguin's owners get a chance to turn their characters into toys. And NFT, yeah, they plunge 62% in January. I know this is a month old, but it's still relevant because if you've been investing in NFTs related to Bitcoin, they've fallen. But this could be the time to jump in and invest a little bit of money if you're into that. Again, this is just something I'm thinking about. And I'm just sharing knowledge with you guys and my feelings on this. And if you want to check it out, it might be, you know, buy low, sell high, right? So we'll have to see what happens. But they fell over 62% as the sales volume on the Bitcoin network has seen significant fall. Value dropped of 61.6% .6 according to CryptoSlam at the time of writing stands at $330,737,889. Look at that big drop off. So it might be time to get in on a little bit check it out transactions have also plummeted by 49 percent according to 245,510 accounts over the past month as the sales volume is substantial and can be seen on the charts now compared to january's 330.7 million dollars december recorded 868 million nine hundred and seventy four thousand thirty one dollars now there were over one hundred and ten thousand two hundred and thirty five unique buyers in december compared to the seventy five thousand eight hundred and forty two in january so that's about a, almost a fifty percent about thirty five percent split as for unique sellers last month saw ninety eight thousand two hundred eighty three whilst this one marked sixty five thousand two hundred and three so you can see some chart changes here as well it's fallen off little began really peaked high there for a bit and then just kind of dropped off that's how markets work right now december also saw double the number of january's transactions of 484,556 therefore the decrease has been seen across the board now last month's strongest day was december the 16th when the network saw an 86 million 82,207 dollars in sales volume just a day earlier, it recorded $85,434,038. Now, as for this month, 
January, so last month, sorry, had the highest sales volume on Bitcoin, recording $18,823,301, and was followed by January 11th, when the network saw $17,359,189. So, we got some ordinals to talk about, specifically Bitcoin, specifically cats, more specifically quantum cats. Anticipated Taproot Wizards Bitcoin Ordinals NFT sale was postponed yesterday due to tech issues as the Quantum Cats whitelist was announced for Monday and was meant to last two hours and supposed to be followed by the public mint lasting until the collection sold out. However, the team moved them into Friday, uh, sorry, to February the 1st, which was almost uh, about three weeks ago now, and the whitelist phase will last five more hours, enabling people in different time zones to mint comfortably. So postponing it. Now this should be live as of right now. If you want to check that out, Quantum Cats should be interesting. Okay, now co-founder Udi Wertemer explained that the minting website did not work as well as expected. That said, during the time it did work, almost 1,000 cats were minted successfully. All funds are safe. He added the cats will be distributed to wallets on Friday. So again, that Friday after the mint. All right, that's going to do it for your NFT news here on Rockstar NFT. Like, comment, subscribe, share. We'll see you guys in the next video. Have a great night.